going on? It's your boy Jay Black, AK Black, and we're at U Dub Network. It's going down in about four days. Um, finally, Shotgun Shug versus Hitman Holly. Yes, I'm doing more promo, but I'm gonna get more into detail about the battle. I'm liking what I, I like. I like what I see in terms of promo from the battlers. We got Shotgun Shug going nonstop on Twitter. We got Hitman Holly going nonstop on Twitter. These guys seem very serious. These guys seem very serious to get set off the year right for battle rap in general. You know what I mean? A, a match of this magnitude is crazy to me. Now, from a blogging standpoint, it would be at my best advantage to stay home and watch the battle on pay-per-view. You know what I mean? I'll be able to recap it just right there because again, it's live. It's not, it's not, it's, it's live pay-per-view. It's not, you wait a day, you wait two days, you get, it's live. Hitman versus Suge is live, so I think that's about twenty to thirty dollars. You know, what I mean, I probably try to put in the description below, but it's live. It will be in my best interest to stay home and watch it and then recap. But no, I gotta get the feel. I gotta get. I got. I, I gotta get the feel. I gotta be down there live in person. I gotta see. I gotta see Hitman going crazy in person. I have to see Suge going crazy in person. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go down there and buy the pay per view. You know what I mean? So I can watch when I get back home. You know what I mean? So y'all won't see my recap for about a day or two. You know what I mean? But I'm pretty sure everyone else will because it's easier for them to recap from the, from the footage. But you know, I wanna talk about keys to victory. You know what I mean? Something I did, my How to Dime versus Joe Button uh, weigh in, which I should have did for this already. You know what I mean? And I apologize. You know what I mean? Keys to victory, meaning what should Shotgun should do? What should Hitman do? What's in their best interest to have them take the battle? First and foremost, for Shotgun Shook, you know what I mean? I think he needs to make his presence felt without the pocket tap. Make his presence felt. He's a big guy. He's literally probably the biggest nigga in battle rap. Let's be real. You know what I mean? It's, it's many ways you can show your dominance without the pocket tap. Because we all know the pocket tap will incite beef, will, will incite, you know, uh, eruption and make the battle go nowhere. At the end of the day, we want this battle completed. We want this battle completed. You know what I mean? Because if this battle gets, gets through three rounds perfectly with no drama, we're talking about a two million view battle on, on Shug's behalf. You know what I mean? It's going to be a, a, something to help his career out, regardless of how you feel about it. So without any physical activity and making his presence felt, this is a good look for him. Win or lose. You know what I mean? Extended rounds. Now he's already on record saying, hey, I might have five minute rounds. Shout out to PSA Radio. I might have five. That's beautiful. That's beautiful that you saying you're gonna have five minutes. That's, I love that. Shake my hand. I love that because we know on average, Suge, this is about two minutes and thirty or two minutes. He does exactly what his contract for. So to him to have extended rounds, that means he's fucking serious. He's not there to play. I'm expecting, I know I say this a lot, but if a guy is literally saying I have five minute rounds, I'm expecting the best possible Shug. Shouldn't you? You know what I mean? I think the polls, let's talk about the polls real fast, the polls. Many polls had Hitman winning by 90%. 90%. Shug, you should use that as motivation. A win is more gratifying when everyone's against you. Am I right? Or am I right? Let everybody, let me or everybody else be against you in terms of winning. And you win that night? And niggas gotta eat their words? And do a blog saying, you know what? Suge definitely took it 2-1 clear. You know how that feels for you? I don't want to interview. I never did want to interview. Let's be real. You know what I mean? Um, I do want you to shake my hand, though. Let's be mad. Anywho, you know what I mean? That's going to be dope. That'd be crazy because I call it like I see it. So if you win, you win. You know what I mean? Regardless of what he does, and if you beat him, I have to do a recap of you beating him. Period. I'm just saying. Let's go, champ! Use being the underdog to your advantage. You know what I mean? They're expecting a lot from Hitman. 
they're expecting a lot from Hitman. Not so much from you, let's be real. If they got, you, if they got Hitman winning 90%, they're not expecting too much from you. So the second that you show out, pun intended a little bit. The second that you show out when you land that first Hitmaker, carry that momentum all the way through. Jay Black, Jay Black, the retarded, the retarded kid named Jay Black said forfeit the first round. Don't listen to him. Jay Black's retarded. He's stupid. Don't listen to him. He doesn't even, I don't know what he's talking about. Fuck him. Anywho. If you bang with Hitman in the first round, and the first round's debatable, Hitman's in for a long fucking night. Bang his first round. Try to knock his first round to park. You know what I mean? Because that's what he's known for. So if the first round is debatable, if Hitman comes off a three-year layoff, two, three-year layoff, and the first round is debatable, and he's known for his first round, he's in for a long night. And that's a fact. So, like I said, don't listen to Jay Black to my some forfeit. Who does? Who's forfeits around? Period. He doesn't know what he's talking about. Let's go, champ! Let's go, champ! Let's be real. Battle rap, in a sense, is WWE. Use all moves. Use all moves except the pocket tap. But what's your life like? I, I expect to hear that. You know what I mean? But also, kind of expect the rebuttal of that. What's your life like? Because during a face-off, it was much like, what's your life like? What you, you didn't hear, you've been here, you're doing it. I'm just saying. Guys, with everything considered, the poll should not be 90% to 10% in favor of Hitman. With what I'm hearing, people that's talking to me, it's more like 55, 45. Going in to Sunday. There's a reason I'm going to have to drive there. There's a reason I, ha I can't stay home and watch this. I have to be in the building for this. I have to. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Those are the keys to victory for sure. Again, we don't want any physical altercations. Even in the slightest, we don't want the... We just saw what happened with another big matchup. We saw that. It took away from the battle. Don't take away from the battle. I'm starting to not, not like pocket taps. Let's be real. I'm starting not to not like those, you know what I mean? I feel like it was all good and dandy when Pocket Taps was just stop. It started there and ended right there and the battle kept going on. But now, <sighs> anywho, keys to victory for Hitman Holla. My, in my opinion, again, who am I? I'm nobody, let's be real, I'm just a fan. Keys to victory for Hitman Holla. Show out has to be in the building, but if I check on Twitter, I think you said show out's gonna be there. We're expecting a remix, you know. You already know that. Um, you're the favorite in this battle, believe it or not. You've been on a two year layoff, like I just said it. We we're expecting a lot from you. You know what I mean? I know people the people say they don't write, they don't write for two years or something, but we're expecting two years with the pain delivered onto Shug. That's what we're expecting. We're expecting a show. I think you should arrive early, earlier than expected. Check out the stage. Because if y'all battling in the same spot that Surf and Shook faced off at, it wasn't too much space. So you want to check in with Ray Swag and Arsenal to make sure you have enough space for your battle. You're a performance guy. You can't perform in, 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 in a small radius. Like, has to be... You can move around, do your hitman stuff, or tag show, all that stuff, bro. <laughs> but to hold on to and do do your thing, you know what I mean. So make sure the stage is probably cleared. I would say that, you know, it's just my opinion, but I think these things would help. The second round and the third round has to be as fire as your first. So if your first round has all that special stuff in it, switch it with your second. If that makes sense to you, I think battle rappers understand that by switching rounds. Because if you know they're gonna go crazy in your first round because of your return, you wanna make sure your hardest stuff is not in that round. People are saying you're known for your first, including me, everyone says it, you know what I mean? Let's be real here. So, I'm just saying. We gotta have gas all the way through. We can't have the gas in the first, then it dies down. 
And you hear it. It's on, it's on radio. It's in the tweets everywhere that he's bringing five minute rounds. You want to at least bring four. You don't want to write to the contractual agreement because if y'all getting this amount, you said 25K on Twitter. So if you getting that, get that to kill a nigga. Make sure he's dead. Y'all paid me to kill him. My name is Hitman. So y'all paid a trained assassin for the hit, man. Now I'm going to holler. I'm just saying. I'm driving down, no shade, no shot to anybody. I'm driving down for this match. This match. I have a friend that's coming with me. You feel me? And he's coming to see you. I'm just saying. He coming there for a show. Let's go, champ! Let's go, champ! Let's go, champ! And for you, Dub, lastly, for you, Dub, you know what I mean? I call, like I see it. People are saying this match should have been here. This match should have been there. All you want to do is facilitate this match to its highest potential. I Meaning that this match starts clean and it finishes clean. And it goes up on YouTube clean. You know what I mean? With no interruptions. That's all people want, to be honest. You know what I mean? Y'all got Itchy House, right? It's gonna look good. That's all the people want. So, salute and shout out to you, Dub. We're gonna be in the building. Me and a few people gonna be in the building. You know what I'm saying? If you cannot make it, again, support the culture. I think the, the, the pay per view is between twenty and thirty dollars. Cop up. They got a whole they got a whole bunch of battles for you to watch. You know what I mean? I'm 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 tuned in to Tay Rock versus uh, Sharon. You know what I mean? I'm tuned in for Arsenal versus Chilla John. I'm tuned in. The Pat Stay is finally in an urban crowd. Ooh. Shout out to Dean. The Pat Stay is finally here. Ooh. Shake my hand, niggas. You know what I mean? Put in the comments below who you think is going to win. But I think it's hearing what I'm hearing, I wouldn't be surprised if Shug shows out. Hearing what I'm hearing, and I don't like hearing from the battle rappers themselves. I like hearing from people around them. Because if you get on the line with a battle rapper, what are they going to say? Yeah, I'm going to beat him 3-0. That's all they're going to say. You know what I mean? Unless you bring out some, pull out some good questions from him or get some good answers from him. It's the same thing. I'm going to win 2-1-3-0. But when you, get, when you talk to people around them, what I'm hearing is going to be a fight. For all y'all thinking Hitman is going to walk over and shook, no, it's going to be a fight. It's going to be a fight. Not a real fight, hope not. But it's gonna be a fight. Let's keep it clean, guys. Black bitch. Shake my hand one last time. I appreciate that. Uh, who say they best, man? Let's bet if they place in the wages a major. Separate me from fake entertainers. Two shades, sipping do seg, and I saved the container to remind me of times I was broke. Sipping bud ice and bud life, love nights.